string in my eye. I'll be an example to myself in the tears that I cry. Getting these masks ready, man, for it's part of an order. Which is gonna be seven of these black masks for a local contractor out here where I live. Some intruder on there, hold on. So Lloyd Works Construction. Actually met him through Facebook. Posted some Black Lives Matter mask. Oh, I'm set. Posted some Black Lives Matter mask for sale. Out here and all the racist people had all this stuff to say. And then he messaged me was like, do I press anything else? You know, do I do other stuff as well? I'm like, yeah. So he's turned out to be a repeat customer. This is the second time I've done masks and shirts. Last time I did the... Uh, this is one I messed up on, but I did these shirts front and back for him. The highlighter this time, he wants black shirts with the same thing, but I'll make the shirts another video. I'm going to just do these masks in this one. Prepping them, sitting here bored. So... Seven of them. Most money, you got that heat press, you got the vinyl cutter, you can make some extra money, man. Finding stuff local. I got some some uh, shirts coming. I'm doing for a local rapper out here, and somebody I know that we mutually know turn him on to me. But uh, like I didn't have the material to do it. So I outsourced it to Mike T. Shout out Mike T. That's my guy right there. That's my YouTube fella right there, man. Y'all go follow Mike T's shirt. He got some good content over there for you. I said follow his shirt, but excuse me, follow his channel. He got some good content over there for y'all, Mike T's. But I'm having him do the prints, paid him, so I had to outsource it. <clears throat> that way, I didn't lose the money. The sale because it was a new new referral to me. And I um you know he made a couple dollars off of it, I make a couple dollars off of it. And then the client will be happy. So you know what I mean, as long as you got that heat press, you got that heat press, you got your vinyl cutter, you can make a little you can make some money. So that's four of them. Three more, and I'm going to press. I like using this little uh, pad. Wrong way. I like using this little pad here, so I'm going to be just pressing four at a time. Or four first and then three. Well, let me get them all laid down. A little intruder. Use this pad because of this. The hem there. Um. So it has some pressure so I can still get my pressure. I'm using Caesar Easy Wee Stretch on these masks. Never, I don't know what happened. It cut off for no apparent reason whatsoever. <clears throat> so I'm using Caesar Easy Wee Stretch on these. It calls for 320 degree, degrees with a firm pressure. And I'm going to use a piece of this parchment to throw over there. 
Just some parchment I picked up at Winco for like a dollar something. Throw a sheet over there. And then again, it's 320 for 320 degrees for 15 to 320 degrees for 15 to 20 seconds at a firm pressure. Whoa, that's a little real firm. <laughs> so that's the first four going down. Bam, there's your mask. Let's remove this first four, let them cool, and I might press them again afterwards, maybe. Check them over. So here's the last three. That one's off. Same piece of parchment paper. Go over the top of that. But that, just having a heat pressure vinyl cutter, you can make good money. Like this is just somebody that ran into through a Facebook post. Like these people was on there, I was selling Black Lives Matter masks on Facebook marketplace and a whole bunch of races and I met this dude, you know what I mean? The roads that grew through the concrete. You never know. I'm gonna hot peel that again. right there 12 going to peril the dream in my eye i be an example to myself in the tears that i cry and then there they go some little extra money in my pocket i got some shirts to do for him too but the shirts are black shirts with this blue that's actually a couple i got a weed but it's information With the same logo in blue going on the front. Twelve going apparel, the dream in my eye. I be an example to myself in the tears that I cry.